a place where I love to be. Look in a book, here's a story for you. Who makes stories when the day is through? Who makes stories when the day is through? Story makers, story makers, working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story makers, stories are fabulous, stories are fun. Presenting Wordsworth. Jackson. Working through the night till the rising <laughs> sun. Story makers, story makers, <laughs> stories are fabulous, stories are fun. Come and be a story maker. Oh, look at the time, everyone. It's time to go home. Let's put the books away. Okay. Come on, Kai. That's it. Night in the library. Hello. Time for all story makers to come out. Are you ready? Sun is down, the stars are bright. Story makers come out at night. <laughs> oh, Rosetti Wordsworth, magical story maker here to make stories with you. Hello. Mm. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. <laughs> Look at all these shapes. Yes, it is Shape Week in the library. Do you know what mm. the shapes are called? Oh, oh, I do, Jackson. Do you, Jelly? Yes, because I heard the children singing the shapes song. Oh, yes, I heard it yeah. too. Shall we sing it now? Oh, yes. Mm. Uh, listen carefully and then you can join in next time. Mm. Circles are round. Squares have four sides. Rectangles, I like them, only tall or wide. Two sides make a triangle, they all end with a point. Stars have so many, and circles don't have any. Stars have so many, and circles don't have any. <laughs> roll up, roll up! It's time for Rosetti's Dotty Circle Show. <laughs> Rosetti! <laughs> what are you doing? Mm. Some spotty dotty magic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Attention, attention, ladies and gentlemen, mm. I give you... <gasps> wow. <laughs> Look at all those things. Yeah. <laughs> but do you know what shape they all are? Oh, um, um, well, mm. well, that's a frisbee and it's a circle. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. A CD. That's a circle too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, and that money's round. Mm. That's a circle. Mm. <laughs> and so is that soap. Mm. And the sticky tape as well. Yes. Yeah. Now, watch them carefully. See if you can remember oh. all of those circles. Mm. 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 OK. Mm. Mm -hmm. We ponder a while over each item, giving you the chance to remember them. Ponder, ponder. Mm. Ponder, ponder, now then. ponder. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, no. I give you... <laughs> Woo! But oh. they're the same. Ah, but is it? Look carefully. Oh, there's something missing, isn't there, Rosetti? Oh, there's sticky <laughs> tape. Mm. Uh, but, oh, no, mm. that's there. Mm. Uh, the soap's still there. Mm -hmm. And the money... Hmm. Do you know which one's disappeared? Hmm. Mm. Uh. Can you give us a clue? Hmm. I think. You can play with it in a park, but don't let it get stuck up a tree. <gasps> oh, I know, I know. It's the frisbee. The frisbee's <laughs> gone. Oh, yeah. That's right, yeah. Jackson. It's the frisbee that's yeah. missing. But, but where has it gone? Oh. <laughs> Aha! Yes. It's gone into the story mm. machine yes. to mm. make a circly story. Mm. Mm. Now, we need some imagination from you to make the story machine work. Yes. So put your hands up, ready to join in with the magic words. Mm. Imagine. Imagine. Imagine a story. Mm. What's it going to be? Oh, it's a plate. 
book. And it's called Circles on My Mind. Mm -hmm. Riding on the path. Go as fast as you like. Pushing on the pedals on my brand new bike. But take a closer look at what I found. Circle wheels that go round and round. Round and round and round and round. Circle wheels go round and round. Playing in the garden. Playing with my mum. Trying to throw a frisbee. Having heaps of fun. But take a closer look at what I found. A circle frisbee that goes round and round. Round and round and round and round. A circle frisbee that goes round and round. Muddy, mucky hands that need a clean. Scrubbing with the soap. But guess what I've seen? Take a closer look. See what I found. A circle soap that goes round and round. Round and round and round and round. A circle soap that goes round and round. I'm hungry now, and it's time for lunch. I hope it's something tasty to munch and crunch. But take a closer look at what I found. Circle food that goes round and round. Round and round and round and round. Circle food that goes round and round. Before I get down, there's something else to eat. A bowl of ice cream. Ooh, my favourite treat. Take a closer look at what I found. A circle bowl that goes round and round. Round and round. A circle bowl that goes round and round. A circle bowl that goes round and round. A circle search is fun, so take a look around. Can you find things that go round and round? A circle on a clock. Or a cushion on a chair. I'm sure you'll find circles everywhere. So what circles did we find? Wheels on a bike? A frisbee. Circle soap. Circle food. A circle ball. A circle on a clock. A circle cushion. <laughs> Bye! Oh, oh, what a lot of circles! Yes, William mm. had circles for bicycle wheels. Yes. And look, Rosetti's tricycle wheels are circles too. But I think they're a bit bigger than William's. I would like a bike with triangle wheels. Well, I don't think you can have triangle wheels, Jelly. Oh, well, why not? Mm. I think they would look so pretty. Oh. All pointy and, uh, um, and triangular. Yeah, but look mm. at my toy cars, Jelly. They all have circle wheels, like Rosetti's tricycle. Mm. Triangle would be better. Oh. Or maybe square. Oh, no. I don't think square wheels would work. Well, well why not? Well, because, um, because, mm? uh, well, well, look, I'm going to put this car in the story machine and perhaps we'll get a story to explain why circle wheels are the best. <laughs> in it goes. <laughs> are you ready to help? Imagine. Imagine, imagine a story. What is it, Jackson? Uh, oh, it's coming. Um, oh, it's a blue cow story, Jelly. And it's called Blue Cow and the Caveman. In a field not far away is a herd of cows grazing quietly. One of the cows is most unusual. Blue Cow wonders. Wonders about the big world beyond her field. One day, Blue Cow was listening to the sound of cars driving past the field. Oh, I wonder what it will be like to invent something like a car. 
she's off again, said the other cows. So Blue Cow caught the bus that stops beside her field. I'd like a ticket to a place where I can invent something, please. There you go, madam. Hold very tight. And they set off for the Stone Age. Then they arrived. Blue Cow was standing in front of a cave. Hello, called Blue Cow. Anything to invent around here? Of course, said a man coming out of the cave. This is the Stone Age. We're inventing things all the time. I'm Professor Pleistocene, local inventor. I'm Blue Cow. I'd love to help you with your inventions if that's OK. Oh, I could do with some help. Uh, follow me. So, Blue Cow followed Professor Pleistocene into the cave. Inside, there were all sorts of things that Professor Pleistocene had invented. Here we are! Said the professor. I've called this a car. It's to get me around more quickly. It doesn't actually move at the moment, though. Hmm, I think I see what the problem is, said Blue Cow. Do you have a hammer and chisel, please? Of course, said Professor Pleistocene. Blue Cow chiselled away at the car's square wheels. Bits of stone flew everywhere. Soon, she'd made all the car's wheels round. You're a genius! Cried the professor. You've just invented the wheel, Blue Cow. I'm off. Need a lift anywhere? Oh, no thanks. I think I'll catch the bus. <laughs> You'll never guess where I've been. Where have you been? I've been to the Stone Age and invented the wheel. Everyone knows that cows can't invent things. But we know they can, don't we? <laughs> Blue Cow invented circle wheels for the caveman's car. Yes, yes. Mm. wheels have to be circles or they won't go round. This is it. The <laughs> wheels on my bike go round, <laughs> round, round, <laughs> round and round, Ooh. round and round. Mm. The wheels on my bike go round and round all night long. <laughs> <laughs> the wheels on my bike go round and round all night long. Oh, I said that was funny. Yeah. The wheels on my bike. <laughs> <laughs> can we sing it again? Oh, I know we can sing. The bell on my bike goes ding a ling a ling. Mm. The, the bell, bell on my bike goes ding a ling a ling. Ding a ling a ling. Ding a ling a ling. The bell on my bike goes ding a ling a ling. All night long. Uh, uh, oh, Rosetti, Rosetti, it's my turn. Uh, I've got one. Ooh. Rosetti on the bike goes round and round. Oh. Round and round. Round and round. round, round, round. Rosetti on the bike goes round, 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 round. round. All oh, night long. Yeah. That was a very good one, Jenny. Yes. Hi, yes. Hey, I think we should stop now. Oh, oh why? why? Well, we do have stories to make, and that is why we're here. Oh, yeah. oh yes. Uh, can we make another circle story for the children? Oh, yes, we could use your spotty dotty hanky. Oh, yeah. That's got circle spots on it, hasn't it? Mm. My spotty dotty hanky? Yes. Yes, it has got circles on it, I suppose. Yes. <laughs> mm. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Are you ready? Mm. Imagine. Imagine. Imagine a story. Ooh, what's it going to be? Is it coming? Hello! <laughs> it's nearly there. Oh, it's a Kevin the Spaceman story. And it's called Spotty Planet. Kevin and Spanner in space to explore, seeking out planets never heard of before. Ooh, uh, moaned Kevin when he stepped out onto the spotty planet. I've got spots in front of my eyes. I think I might be ill. Spanner knew what he meant. He thought he'd better lie down. Oh, watch out, came a voice. Don't lie on me. No lying on spots allowed. A large orange spot had popped up in front of him. Kevin thought it might be difficult to find anywhere else to lie. And since you're here, you'd better wear this spot too. Suddenly, a yellow spot appeared on Spanner's space coat. And this, 
came another voice. It was a red spot this time. <laughs> Spanner was upset. Kevin wasn't wearing any spots. Oh, and he'd better have some too, exclaimed the red spot. Instantly, Kevin was wearing yellow and red spots. That's better. We like to make our visitors feel at home, said the spots. Thank you very much, said Kevin bravely. I'm Kevin, and this is my dog, Spanner. Welcome to the spotty planet, said the spots. We like everything spotty. Yes, yes, we do. Spots in the spot, chorused a large crowd of spots which had gathered around them. Now then, you must be hungry after your travels. Do you fancy a spot to eat? Spanner was very hungry. Oh, yes, please, said Kevin politely, if it's not too much trouble. Oh, no trouble, smiled the red spot. Follow us and mind where you step. Kevin and Spanner walked slowly, trying not to step on any spots. Spanner wondered if spots liked bones. Help yourself, said the red spot, pointing to some small spots shooting up from a big purple spot. Oh dear, said Kevin. Are you sure? Oh, don't worry, said the orange one. These are special spots which we grow as our food. Green spots are vegetable and the brown spots are chocolate. Spanner sighed. No bones. Oh well, chocolate was the next best thing. He munched hungrily on some brown spots. Kevin tried a green one. It was yummy. Oh, and the white ones are bone flavoured, added the red spot. Spanner was surprised. He hadn't noticed the white ones. He tried one. They were delicious. Steady on, Spanner, said Kevin. You'll burst. Oh, no, chorused the crowd of spots. No bursting allowed. At last, Spanner was full. He wasn't sure if he could walk to the rocket. Never mind, Spanner, said Kevin. We'll go slowly. Kevin and Spanner waved goodbye to their new friends. Be careful not to step on any spots, they shouted. We will, answered Kevin. Thank you, agreed Spanner. Maybe spots were not such a bad thing after all. I would like some chocolate spots. Oh, yes. What flavour spots would you like, Jackson? Yeah. <laughs> I'd like strawberry ice cream. Oh, yes, I'd like some of those too. <laughs> well, that's the last of the three circly stories for the children. <gasps> They'll be coming back soon. <laughs> Look. Yes, my sweet. <laughs> Dawn is upon us. The morning is nigh. We've made our stories and we bid you... Goodbye. Story makers, story makers, working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story Goodbye makers, for now. Are fabulous story Come back and see us soon. Come and make some more stories soon. <laughs> <laughs>